Hi loves, welcome to my channel, it's your girl Princess Bella. In today's video, right, I'm going to be doing some review with this V Beauty Sunset Lip Collection. If you want to get to understand what lip palette is all about, I mean, you want different varieties of lipsticks, but you don't want to keep buying them one after the other, you just want to use one stone to kill 12 beds. In this video, you're going to find out whether you should go for this Lady V Beauty palette because this is what I'm going to be reviewing with. So let us try and focus on my lips and avoid the eyes. I had a different video before now where I did this eye makeup and kind of also did a different review for a different eyeshadow but this video is going to be all about lipstick so just to pretend that the only thing you're looking at right now is my lips okay is it possible are we going to enjoy it yes of course that's exactly what we're going to do now so the lip colors are this is the lip color that it came with let me show you from the back so you don't get distracted so this is what it looks like I'm going to create up to six different lip colors with this lipstick palette okay and I'm going to tell you exactly what I think about them I love the similarities in color I love that if you want to outline your lips you can actually outline your lips with a darker color and they use a softer color that is still within the same you know the same color range and then use it to create some kind of ombre something so I'm going to also be creating different looks with this lipstick in this video right now so that also if you're not very sure of how to use lipsticks and all of that this video is really 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 something you shouldn't miss at all so guys before I start anything I am going to use this chapstick to moisturize my lips so right now the first lipstick I am going to wear this nude lip color right now but then I don't see any color that is going to make it pop out as much as it would hence I'm going to go on and use this NYX soft matte lip cream in number 23 I wanted to use this nude initially but I'm I'll be getting towards this color right now so I'm just going to use this color right now and perhaps my still use this I don't know I'm just going to be playing around these colors so first of all I'm going to use this color on my lips straight up with a lip brush I like that it is easy to blend out I like that it is not as matte as dry as powder I like that it still have a soft matte application is not wet but i would say that it has a matte a soft matte application on the lips i am going to clean up my lips right now and i'm going to apply the next nude color so guys at this moment i cleaned off the lipstick on my lips and right now i want to finally apply this nude this beautiful nude color on my lips okay and because and because the first lip liner I used on my lips hasn't completely cleaned off, I'm just going to use a new bl a brush and then apply it directly on my lips without outlining my lips because my lips still looks outlined. Alright guys, that was a close-up shot for that particular lips, alright, so I'm just going to gloss it up just so you see what it looks like with glosses. I love, so this is what my lips looks like after glossing it. I think I like the nude. When I saw it initially, I didn't like it that much, but now after putting it on my lips, especially after glossing it up, God, I feel so much at home with it. I mean, look at how beautiful it is now. What do you think, really? Do you think it's cute? What do you think? Tell me which of them is going to be your favorite. And I'm also going to tell you the one I love, the one that I love most. So next, I'm going to use these two colors on my lips right now. I'm going to use this color here to outline my lips, and I'm going to use this color to put in the inner part of my lips. So this one will be at the outer part, and this one will be in the inner part of my lips. Then I'll try and blend everything together, if that makes sense. This color is also called, I like it hot. I mean, you want to be hot, but you don't want to be shouting. This color is hot, but not shouting. So, this is what it looks like at the moment. And this is what the clothes look looks like at the moment also.
guys i don't think that this lip palette is a matte lip palette but i love the way it is sliding on my lips i love the fact that it's not too wet and i love the fact that it slides on my lips on my lips effortlessly and it blends really really well so guys next i'm going to jump over this pure pink color what i like to use to line my pink lipsticks is always a soft purple color so guys this is exactly what the pink lipstick came out with so next guys i'm going to use this classic makeup usa lipstick in wine red i'm going to use it to outline my lips and afterwards i'm going to put in this lip color in the inner corner of my lips so right now i'm going to use a lip brush to pick up some products from the lipstick i don't want to apply the lipstick directly on my lips so guys this is what a close-up look looks like okay so i am going to so talk to me in the comment section do you like this one do you like it do you like what which of them do you like most talk to me in the comment section as you're viewing don't go and peep into the one i like most i'm going to say the one i like most by the end of the video so next guys i'm going to use this wine color should i call it wine or should i call it burgundy i'm going to use this color on my lips and i'm going to use this classic wine lipstick to outline my lips so loves this is what we come up with eventually i love this lip color i absolutely love this lip color and i think it's gorgeous i think it also complements my skin color what do you think i'm going to go on ahead and add a little gloss on my lips So this is what a close-up shot looks like in glosses okay so i think i prefer it without glosses but then it definitely still works very well with glosses tell me which one you like is it with gloss or without glosses which one do you prefer <laughs> talk to me please i still have these three colors i haven't tried out these three colors but right now i want to try out this color and this color because this is my perfect red shade i like this this red more than this one this one is very beautiful on people that are very light skinned i'm not that light skinned so i love this one on me because i consider it to fit me very well so i'm going to use this burgundy color and outline my lips then i choose to call this one a blue toned red i am going to use this blue toned red on the inner corner of my lips and then let's wash out to see what it how it turned out and all of that so guys this is precisely what it looks like right now i have never worn this amount of lipsticks all my life in the same day so but anyway i wanted to make this review for you guys so this is what it looks like at the moment so loves that is going to bring me to the end of this video today okay um I love the V Beauty lip color i specifically love it because i'm not a very big fan of lipsticks that are just too dry if you're trying to blend it out it will not blend it will not blend easily or if you're trying to apply it on your lips it will not come out then if you not make any small mistake you'll not be able to clean it readily i know i mean i can work with anything on my lips for real but i love lipsticks that will give you a chance to blend out things and to if you want it matte, if I wanted it matte, I would have probably used concealer on my lips instead of a lip balm, okay? But this lip color, they're not really matte. I won't say they're matte because I consider them to be to have some creamy velvet feeling, but then they blend in really well and they don't look like they will be able to wear out that soon, okay? So I I think I love the lipstick. I think I love the color variations. I think the colors are wearable. I've seen people create lipsticks with colors such as dark green, blue, white. I mean, you can work with white, but I don't see people wearing dark blue and dark green on their lips or even black on their lips. But then, just for the sake of drama and all of that, these colors are wearable colors. There is no how you will not like up to five or six colors in this palette and their variations are not so different just in case you want to blend out things on your lips okay please talk to me in the comment section will you be considering trying it out just in case you wanted a a, a lipstick palette like i said this particular palette right now is not matte it is it has a creamy velvet finish but then blending it out is very easy and 
it slides on greases on effortlessly on the lips like blending it out is just very easy you can go over the it with some gloss some clear gloss if you don't want it that glossy you can actually use just i don't know just play around it and if you ask me what i think about this lipstick i'll say it is 10 over 10 because it has colors i love it also slides on effortlessly on my lips if you're asking me the one i like best i'm supposed to like this color best honestly i'm actually supposed to like this color best followed by this one this blue toned red and then maybe you now come to the peach side the this this color this color is supposed to be my third best but then when i apply this nude on my lips I loved myself. I loved the way the thing came out. I loved the way the thing complemented my skin color. I didn't expect it from the nude. In all honesty, the one I like best is the is the nude one. Okay, so so love. This is going to be the end of the video for today. Okay, like the video. Give it. Give this video a thumbs up if you think you got value for your time. Dislike the video if you think you didn't get value for your time. Or if you think you don't like the way I played ar around with colors in this video. Just dislike it for me. But somehow you should either like or dislike this video. Talk to me in the comment section. Tell me the one you like best. Tell me whether you like lip palette. Tell me if you still find applying lipstick on your lips difficult even after watching this whole thing just talk to me in the comment section if there is a video you would want me to film for you please don't forget to tell me in the comment section i'm looking forward to reading your comments and responding back also and then i will see you in my next video bye